the war in Li the destruction of Libya, the or the fabric of the site, I mean the implication has been so grave for both the Libyans, for other Africans, for Nigerians, and for the war. Because it was totally unnecessary. Libya was a big stabilizing force in Africa. Uh, because I mean, whether you like Gaddafi or not, he had, he had a pan-African understanding. And Africa needs to become Ideally, I would prefer Africa to be one country with territories, democratic territories, based on previous and affinities. Uh, so independent territories within one country. Because we are one people, irrespective of where we are located, irrespective of the colors of our skin. Uh, so the assault on Libya was an assault on Africa. It was an assault on an idea that Africa could stand on its own, and that African country can support other African countries without having to depend on the West or on the East or on anybody outside the continent. So, the this was a deliberate, deliberate, deliberate destruction. So as also to grab the resources, the oil. While the conflict was going on, while Gaddafi was being chased around, the oil was being exported already. And, and so, it is it, one of the most vicious display of greed, of immorality of uh, lack of care or lack of humanity. They just look at other people as objects or that don't count at all. Now, the war on Libya, the degradation of the political system has thrown up a state where, um, I don't want to say the state of anarchy, but a state where there's less cohesion. And because of the conflict on the continent, as well as from global warming, a lot of young people want to go to Europe. And Libya is a transit point. And Nigerians are being held as slaves, as you say. Yeah, this is not natural. It is, this, is, this is all a result of a situation where people have been traumatized. But the victims on those who are, who are, who are carrying out these actions. And so it's, it's, a, it's a complex system, really. And the implication of the proliferation of weapons and arms in the Sahel it's also a result of, of so much weapons being pumped into in the conflict in the Maghreb region. 